This fits the female. A day-long photo safari through the woods and streams of Arlington County. Experts and volunteers are cataloging the diversity of life in this densely populated Washington suburb. We got a twofer. We got both a northern water snake species and an American eel. Alonzo Abugadas is Arlington County Natural Resources Manager. His job is to protect and improve the county's natural spaces. Everyone knows that if you want to protect something, you got to know what you have. Yep. Oh, okay. northern oh, brown, brown, northern brown. brown. The group is using an app called iNaturalist to keep track of their observations. Abugadas says crowdsourcing will identify what they find. I can take a good picture, and this is what I think it is. Now I throw, put it out to the world, and many other people, some of which are experts, can chime in whether I'm right or wrong. The iNaturalist app logs where and when the picture was taken, so experts like Abugadas can map where creatures are living and how that's changing over time as conservation efforts meet urbanization, habitat loss, and climate change. Are some things that we had then no longer here? Are some things that we never knew we had now popping back up? And that'll give us a gauge of how good we're, or how poorly we're doing, you know, we're doing as far as being stewards. And that's important, not just in Arlington, but around the world. The diversity of life is under threat, says iNaturalist co-director Scott Lurie via Skype. Species are going extinct at an unprecedented rate. And we've just only begun to understand exactly how those ecosystems contribute to our food system, our human health, and all these things we depend on. Mm. Lori says iNaturalist lets citizen scientists help professional scientists gather data. More than 100,000 iNaturalist observers on all seven continents have made more than 4.5 million observations so far. Their data have been part of studies on monarch butterflies, bats that may carry Ebola and more. Back in Arlington, the group logged more than 450 species, including the biggest puffball mushroom anyone had ever seen. If you just open up your eyes to the natural world, you'd be amazed at what's out there. Okay, cool. Steve Barragona, VOA News, Arlington, Virginia. That one's upside down.